I was going to mention something else here with Mr. McGinnis. Uh, along those lines, the, uh, we know that the DNC and Move On and Organize for America are coming in to support Democrat candidates on the state level really, really hard. And they have they been for years. Right. Well, they, they have, have been. been they're really going to do it this time yeah, because they think they can take that's state house back. That's, that's what I'm telling you. Too. That's, and well, and we from are. governor on <laughs> down, they're, they're going to make a hard run at it. That's right. I spoke they're with Andy down. Brown this weekend, and he seemed mm -hmm. to think that he had a lot of confidence. Yeah. Yeah, we, it's okay. not in the bag. We've got to get out there and work. But I'm confident about the the slate of, of candidates that we've got, including <clears throat> Patrick yeah, here. Yeah, we've got some extra candidates. We, you know, and we're running against them uh, across the board. So right. I'm, I'm elated right. about where well, we are got, right now. You've got I mean, more I, in this I candidate than we've ever had. Exactly. we got a lot of candidates, and I think it's the quality of the candidates. And strong right. candidates. So I think, exactly uh, right. you know, uh, I, I can rest on my background as a mm – -hmm. I can rest on your background, too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I like Go ahead and do that. <laughs> but I and I and I think a lot of the candidates, uh, you know, Mike and and we got Mary Lou Seraphine. We've got we've got Marilyn Jackson. And, Marilyn uh, Jackson's right. a good one. We've got right. uh, and the other state rep candidates. We got Paul Workman, Dan Neal, yeah. one of the former uh, yeah. uh, NFL, NFL stars. Right. And uh, you know, statewide, we, I the, understand. The we've got really is, yeah. yeah. Right. When we go to the people, are we the better candidate? Are we the are, do we have the better uh, message: Are we the ones who can say that? Look people in the eye, and say, "Yeah, you, you're going to be well represented by me," and I can say that to the people of District 50. And, and, I and believe that you know I'm I'm living and working the kind of life that many of them them lead. You know, as someone who works at Freescale, uh, you know, I talk to folks in Dell, IBM. Uh, I've, I've got kids in the Round Rock schools. I've I really understand the issues that people face in the in the in the district. And I understand the, the challenges that the state of Texas faces. And I think the same can be said. Mike has been very eloquent about the issues that the, the county is, is facing. And I think, you know, there, there are people who maybe they didn't feel like they had a choice before, but now they do. They've got an, an excellent choice. And I think we can, uh, we're out to offer it to them. And I'll, the, I think the answer to the, the Andy Browns and the, and the other folks is, we understand that they're going to work hard, but this time we're working very we're hard. We're working too. hard too. That's right. Yeah. So, people, and, people and people are excited. They That's are, right. they are motivated to get out and and get involved stand up the for the right. principles because they see, they don't like what's going on. Uh, we talked about there's there's yeah. a, there's a hankering to basically let the incumbents know who have let us down, who That's are right. spending money we don't have on right. on programs that don't work to say. Enough is enough. We really have to fix this and get back to accountable, responsible government.